What is happening guys? Mike here, welcome back to the channel. Today I got a pretty cool video planned for you. I'm gonna be giving you guys a little update on my hair and a tutorial on how I've been using some products lately to achieve my style. We're also gonna be hearing from my new buddy, Mr. Cameron Cretney, who's gonna be giving us a little bit of the same kind of update on his style and of course offer up some styling tips as well. So what have I been doing with my hair lately? Well, it's obviously nothing super dramatic. It's not a, a huge change like I had back in November with my forward quiff, but right now I am growing my hair back out from that quiff and I think I'm pretty much now at the length that I was prior to that big change. I think my plans right now are really just to keep it growing. I don't know how long I'll go right now. I'm just kind of rolling with it, but I'm interested in hearing what you guys think on where I should go from here. Keep in mind though, my sides generally don't work well for me when I grow them out and I don't usually change up my hairstyle a whole lot other than little minor tweaks here and there so that I can still produce good styles and test both pomades and salon style products regularly. That being said, though, let's talk a little bit about some products that I've been using in my personal time. I am testing so many products right now, but in my personal time, one product that I've been using a ton is Cavalier by Blumont and Cameron Cretney. This is one product that I go to when I want something reliable and easy to work with and something that does the job fast and efficiently. Some of you may remember I've already actually done a video review on this one, so check out that for my detailed thoughts, but I am going to go through how I've been using it lately and I'm going to start start with using a pre-styler. And for that, I'll be using the Texture Tonic by Damon Barber. I too reviewed this recently and I'm using it here to get a good foundation for the style and it will also pay off heavily in the post-styling step. After applying the tonic, I then begin to blow dry on high heat and since I'm going for volume and texture, I will blow dry in all directions while also concentrating on the direction I want the hair to go to help tame my slight wave I have in that area. After things are all dry, I also blast it with the cold air to seal in the style and bring out that nice dry finish. Now it's time to add in the Texture King. I start off with just enough to get what I want. This is exactly how much I use every time and I make sure I'm working it in completely. Depending on how my hair is behaving that day, I may add in just a little more, but the biggest tip here is you can always add more, but you can't take away any if you add too much. Here is my end result. I especially love how this product goes through that little shift after a bit and unleashes that texture and volume. And hopefully using these techniques will help you use that to your advantage as well. But now that we've seen how I use this product, let's send it on over to Cam to get a look at his awesome style. What's up everyone? Uh, my name is Cameron Cretney. For those of you who don't know me, I run a men's lifestyle channel here on YouTube as well. The kind of content you can find on my channel is anything related to men's hair, fashion, grooming, and fitness. First of all, huge thanks to Mike for having me here on the channel today but I am going to go into depth about how I style my current look um, it's very very easy to do it's very simple uh, and it only takes a few minutes being that I have short hair right now so the product I'm going to be showcasing today is my collaborative product with uh, Blumon and that is Cavalier clay now before we just throw that in our hair we have a few steps we got to take beforehand first step you want to take is make sure you have wet to damp hair the pre style we're gonna be using today is one of the most versatile products out there and that is Blue Mon's original. So what this product is going to do when activated by the blow dryer is it's going to provide fullness, volume, uh, texture, and also control, which is the most important. And not only that, it does have heat protection elements built in. Now because I want to style my hair into a fringe and I really want to maximize texture, I'm going to use my fingers uh, while I blow dry. And what I'm going to do is point it in the direction that I want it to go but then also I'm gonna push it into the opposite and this is gonna help give us volume. So finger combing is definitely a great technique to use because it's definitely gonna help give us separation in the hair, which we want. So this is definitely one of the simplest ways to get texture. So now that our hair is dry, it's time to put the final touches on the hairstyle. So with Cavalier Clay, a little bit goes a long way. If you use too much, you could get an oily look, so definitely start with less and then add more if needed. As the product goes in, because it is an oil-based clay, it's very, very heavy, so you gotta make sure you really emulsify it in your hand and then apply it thoroughly to your hair. Now, once it's in your hair, go ahead and style it to your desired look. Um, I'm the type of person who likes to fiddle around probably way too much, but that's just me. Uh, I like to get things exactly perfect. But once you're finished, you should have a very textured crop look. I think it's a super great hairstyle. 
uh, for anybody looking to add some dimension. And one last thing to know about Cavalier Clay is this product is definitely aimed for thicker hair types, so definitely keep that in mind. So that's about it, guys. You know, check yourself out in the mirror, make sure you're looking good before you head out the door, and uh, you guys will be looking fly in no time. So thank you so much for having me on the channel today, Mike. Uh, it was much appreciated. If you guys wanna go check out Mike's video, he will be doing a collaboration with me over there so make sure you guys uh, go check that out all right guys take care and i'll see you around the channel all right i hope you guys enjoyed that big thanks to cam for hopping in this video with me today make sure if you guys haven't already to check him out over there on his channel i'll actually be popping up there in his version of this video so make sure you check that out as well if you do want to pick up some cavalier i do have a coupon code for you guys to save yourself a little money just type my name in there in the coupon section at bloomon.com and that'll save you 10 percent. i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you again for checking it out and make sure you smash that like button for me and consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. Make sure you also have those notifications turned on. I got a couple of awesome videos coming your way and I know you guys won't want to miss them. But that is it for today. Thanks again for stopping by the channel. Take it easy. I'll see you next time.